Hello class. Welcome back to our math lessons. Today we are going to be reviewing double plus one math facts. Let's take a look at some of them. Nine plus eight is 17. Three plus two is five. Seven plus six is 13. Five plus four is nine. Eight plus seven is 15. Six plus five is 11. Seven plus eight is 15. And four plus three is seven. We're gonna take a closer look at some of these double plus one facts. Let's take a look. Hello class, welcome to today's math lesson. Today, we are going to be looking at doubles plus one math facts. Let's take a look. Now you already know your doubles facts. If you add one plus one, what would be the answer? One plus one is two. And two plus two is four. Three plus three is six. Four plus four is eight. Five plus five is 10. And six plus six is 12. Hmm, what if I made it a little trickier than that? What if we had three plus three? Hmm, but I added one to one of the sides. On this tower, I've added an extra one. So it's not three plus three anymore, it's three plus four. Hmm, we could still add three plus three is six, plus one more is seven. What if we're adding two plus two? Well, we know that two plus two is four. But what if I added one more to one of the towers? Now we have three plus two. It's not a doubles fact. It's a doubles plus one fact. Well, we can still add two plus two, four, and one more, five. Three plus two is five. What if we're adding four plus four? Well, you know that double fact. Four plus four is eight. <gasps> but what if we added one more to one of the towers so that it is five plus four? <gasps> five plus four is one more than four plus four. Let's count it out by twos. Two, four, six, eight, <gasps> and one more, nine. Five plus four is nine. Five plus five is, you know, that's right, it's 10. Two, four, six, eight, 10. Well, what if we didn't have five plus five? What if one of our towers had one more so that it was six plus five? Can you guess what six plus five would be? It's one more than five plus five. If five plus five is 10, one more added to it would be 11. Here I have two towers with six on them. Six plus six is two, four, six, eight, 10, 12. Six plus six is 12. What if I added one to one of the towers? Well, now we have seven plus six, and the answer is gonna be one more than 12. What's one more than 12? You're right, it's 13. Let's count it. Two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 13. Let's take a closer look at these two towers. When I put them down this way, I call them trains. Let's count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And they're both the same, so it's 10 plus 10. And you know that 10 plus 10 is 20. Two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20. Well, if we add one to one of our trains, it's going to be one more than 20. Hmm. What's one more than 20? Yell it out. 
You're right. It's 21. Class, thank you so much for reviewing doubles plus one facts. We're going to continue to review these. And I hope that you have an opportunity to play with some doubles plus one. You could use your Legos or any little toy that you might have. Have a wonderful day, class. Bye-bye.